texting. I please is that real? Yes, is that, that's it, it, real. It is Hell real. yeah, we're seeing Incineroar. Hey, let's go, Incineroar. And, and he's rocking the Big the Cat. Big the Cat, let's go. Fishing mini game confirmed in Sonic Frontiers. It's real. <laughs> All right, so we are gonna. Okay, well, I I still believe in the Incineroar. It's getting a little getting a little rocked in the corner right now but we're gonna see trying to threaten john at the ledge right now with some down tilts trying to get some ledge trapping set up oh and for the counter yeah i feel like that's gonna be huge in this matchup it's just the way that john likes to like pepper and poke you with like sun salutations and soccer balls vivi is gonna be getting a lot of revenge out of that but is he gonna get the clothesline is the main question yeah, it is definitely going to be coming down to, like, the, are you... Uh, what a jump read. Hey, the, clo the clothesline. Give me your neck. And deep breathing now on deck. John, I feel like, really has to be careful if he's going to be throwing out any sort of hitboxes. Because, like, a, revenging a deep breathing hitbox is going to put so much more revenge on the board for Vivi, as opposed to just a normal hitbox. Uh, yeah, not to mention that, that the revenge uh, uh, hurts uh, pretty hard. It's, uh, uh, if you, you end up getting hit by... Oh, that's a jumpless John now off stage. Has to find his way back, but Vivi, Vivi choosing not to go out and edge guard. He knows better. He, he, he understands uh, the ledge and, and John are, are best friends. They know better. They know better. Sorry. Oh, uh, so, uh, could. All right, so now we're seeing VB getting put off stage again. Use that high recovery, but John ready this time. What a whiff punish coming in from VB, putting John back off stage again. Let's see, but that time John reading the, uh, air, or the spot dodge. Right, um. No. Now we're seeing the sort of game plan falling apart for Vivi, but not that time. That I don't know what that DI was. John just exploded. That wasn't even a revenge or anything. Looking for a cheeky little revenge conversion there, but not finding it. All right. N now, uh, now John does of course doesn't need need to look, look carefully um because re revenge is up and 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 they and they can uh, p potentially kill them if uh, they're not careful yeah maybe coming in a little bit too early there with uh with that uh side b again but i mean we, we are still seeing vb with the lead right now it just comes down to whether or not they can get these more meaningful hits only 23 percent on John right now, looking for a uh, tech read right there, not quite finding it. Good patience there by John and uh, catching VB coming in with the dash attack. Ooh, that's another jumpless John we're seeing. No, but VB again looking for uh, two frames instead of trying to um, instead of trying to finish the edge guard. Uh, uh, but yeah, this this does look to look to be an even game and. Uh, and VB can potentially close this out if he manages to quite get a nice conversion with uh, with with the clothesline. Yeah. All right, dash tag not quite doing it yet. So it's somehow almost taking it for John in this game one. We're gonna see, but VB able to just come in with a neutral air. John not ready to cover at that time. Scrambles. We're just throwing out hitboxes. Ooh. Wow, I cannot believe he got hit by that. It like just barely caught the, the feet. But oh. misses the sun salutation. That's a dub in the bag for Incineroar. <laughs> Incineroar. Uh, depending on how you look at it, was uh, pretty, pretty amusing. Uh, well, let's see. The clothesline uh, taking out uh, uh, their, uh, their first stock. Yep, I, so. I still can't believe I, I'm, CV, I'm seeing uh, BB playing in Cinderella out of all characters. I think I saw them. I think I saw them pull it out at Waypoint the other night. 
But mm. I mean, I, I felt like that's just kind of you know messing around. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is, is winner's semis right now against John Numbers and VB. You know, showing that they're Incineroar is nothing to nothing to sleep on. Pre pretty much. Uh, but we are we are going to go on a salty run back on on a small battlefield. Let's see. Ooh, I love the patience there from both Vivi and John. But that time getting the uh, oh. neutral air dodge caught Re by the sun citation. And and revenge is currently on deck. Yeah, Vivi just swinging at the ledge right now. Just wants to use this revenge. But I mean, if you're swinging near John Numbers, John Numbers knows how to beat mashing. And right now, with a 100% lead, Vivi has to recover low, but John not able to close out the edge guard. Instead, Vivi's going to be finding their way back into center. But what spacing outside of that Alolan whip? Yeah, good. Uh, oh. Uh, thankfully, okay, um, Vivi okay, did, did not get punished okay, by, by that uh, forward, forward tilt there. Yep, all right, and let's see, Vivi still hanging on to their first stock, and now if they can get John off of off of ledge again Ooh, without that. a jump, but instead uh, committing just that. a little bit too hard yeah, to that, that uh, up B. Yeah, that was a hard commitment on, on, off stage, oh, and 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 they rightfully got punished for it. Yeah, I think. I, I honestly, I feel like I kind of want to see Vivi get a little bit more. Um, confident in throwing out the revenges like right there i'm not sure what vv got out of parrying the soccer ball instead of just revenging it. i feel like you know frame advantage wise you're roughly around the same spot john was so far off of the ledge but if you're able to get the revenge then you become that much more threatening mm-hmm me Maybe, maybe he, he, he thought he, maybe they thought they could, uh, uh, make a court, make it work a court by, by sort of intimidating a court, court John with the fact that they have, they have revenge and that they could, a court, court, court die any moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, coming in with the uh, darkest lariat shield pressure. John <coughs> not phased in the slightest. Does shield all three hits. And Vivi now really struggling to stay in this game too. It felt it feels like all of the um, all of the momentum has been shifted to John, and the neutral wins for Vivi have been getting more few and far between. Yes. It, oh, all right. We, we got another revenge. Oh, and and and, a, and, and a missing uh, neck. That's just that's just Incineroar things. And, and I do like Incineroar things. It's, it, it's nice to see Incineroar co 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 being played in, in tournament. Yeah, and I mean, I really feel like that's how Vivi is going to have to play this matchup. Just because of how how defensively John plays neutral, I feel like you can't just neutral out this, this matchup. For lack of a better term, you kind of have to gimmick it out. And speaking... No way. No shot? No. Speaking of gimmicks, John, not happy. I mean, who would be? You died at like 45. And Senroy, of course, it is is an oppressive character. No, no one of course, wants, wants to be clotheslined of course, of course, of course, by them. Yeah, I mean, that's just, you know, Vivi recognizing that win condition is when you start to, when you're able to threaten with revenge, even if you're not actively connecting,